Okay, so today we're here at Maddie's Kitchen, a quiet little eatery that has built quite a fan base for its casual tzatzah dishes. Not only that, it's also affordable. Where else in Orchard can you get good food for less than $10? That's right, and they're well known for their beef hall bun and pork chop rice. So, let's find out what makes the food so delicious. Yeah, I heard it's the wok day delicious. Alright, we are here with one of the star dishes of Maddie's Kitchen and that's the beef hor fun. Mm -hmm. This is no ordinary hor fun because it's the big chunks of beef. They use quality tenderloin beef, not any cheap cuts. That's right. And they've also topped it up with black beans and bitter gourd to give that, you know, depth of flavour. Yeah. You ready to dig in? Yes, of course. Alright, but... Oh wow. Right. Now the wok here is really on point. On point, on point. Mm -hmm. Whoa. Check out the size of these oysters. These are Korean oysters and they are huge. So the good thing about this style of oyster omelette, it really showcases how plump and juicy looking this oyster is. Yep, these so you have a bite of oyster, I have a bite of omelette and let's see how it tastes. Yeah. This is really different from like your regular hawker style oyster omelette. You can really taste how crispy the egg is because it's fried separately from the oysters. Oh. And you know what about the good thing about this oyster is it's really juicy though. It just tastes like the best fried oyster you would ever have. Okay, so now here we have with us is the pork chop rice and you see this huge serving, it's only 580. Usually you use a batter with breadcrumbs, mm -hmm. right? And this is not, it's not but Apparently they use cream crackers like our soda yeah. So they actually crush up the crackers and use it with the batter, so. Oh, okay. Pork chop. Okay, let's try it. Oof! Right, you got the curry, spiciness, a little bit sweet. You got the essence, uh, the smells of the Hainanese flavor mm -hmm. in, the, in the curry. And then you've got your crispy on the outside, tender on the inside pork, pork chop. This is good curry rice. Right, so the one that we're having today, this fish head curry, is a red snapper, but you can also get it as a red grouper. The rumba for the curry is made in house. In house? It's made from scratch in house. So. Okay, okay. Good. You can really taste how fresh all the ingredients is in this curry. This is the uh, norhyang that they have here, which is uh, made in house. What I noticed is they've got a generous amount of that uh, water chestnut. Gives it a nice crunch. Mm -hmm. And the bean cut skin taste actually comes out at the end and that is really nice. So come on down to Maddie's Kitchen, try out some of their great options like for lunch you can have the pork chop curry rice all the way to your dinner food like your fish head curry and your tzatzah favourites like beef hor fun. If you want to come down during the weekends, do try to make a reservation because it can get quite busy. If you like more content on food recommendations, do like and subscribe. And share, share. Yeah. So see you next time. See you.